Good morning. As we have ended our mid-year prayer and fasting, I am just excited for what the Lord has in store for all of us. This year will be an amazing year. God will be with us every step of the way, and you will witness what God can do right before your eyes. This is why, as I have exhorted you last Thursday in the book of Genesis chapter 8, verse 1, it says right here, but God remembered Noah. That passage validates that God will never forget whatever promises He has spoken. So I hope starting today and in the next six months, you will trust God because He is a great God, He is a good God, and He is a faithful God. That you don't have to just let go and give up of the faith that God has placed in your life because He will surely fulfill what He has promised. And more than just the promises of God, if you read the story of Noah, you will understand that when he left the ark after the water has receded, it says right here in verse 20, then Noah built an altar. That the bottom line of everything that we're believing God for is not just for us to be blessed, but for you to understand that the glory belongs to God. So this year will be a year of telling our stories and the breakthroughs that we have received but more than all the stories and the breakthroughs, we want God worship, glorified, and lifted high. So once again, I just want to thank you for being part of our mid-year prayer and fasting. God bless you and have a great day.